All right, come on, let's go. Inside the Calhoun Family Investment Center, you'll find a celebration like no other. We're just celebrating the holidays with the community, a community that we are from. A Christmas celebration put on by a new nonprofit, Brothers Concerned for Gilpin, that was planned 45 days ago. Here we're trying to find out and make sure that we help the community grow and be able to move forward with the city and not be left behind. On Saturday, the organization helped feed hundreds of families in Richmond's Gilpin Court. I know we prepared for at least 1,500 people. Before handing out toys, clothes, supplies, and even some bikes to families in need. Well, it doesn't take much for kids. You toys, you know, they got to play, but they didn't want to eat. They wanted to get over to the next room. And it humbles me to even know that somebody does their care about these kids these days. Letitia Hayes was among those who stopped by Saturday, adding that the organization's kind act is much appreciated, especially with the uptick in gun violence happening throughout the city. It was too much, and everybody needed to stop the violence. They're just supposed to care about each other, not knock each other down. Come on, Miss Denise, we got to roll! Over in Henrico's East End. Today is our annual Bikes for Christ Drive. Christmas continues to come early as Worship and Praise Church hands out nearly 300 bikes for registered families in need. It's all about the children today. And um, we're giving a little love on Christmas Day and the volunteers are here to share their heart and love for the community. It's all about community. In the end, organizers say it's just a simple helping hand they can offer to help spread some holiday cheer. For them to not have to worry about some small things just for a day, it's a good day. Now, the organizers of Brothers Concerned for Gilpin tell me that they plan on making this event a annual tradition. And they also say you can drop off donations next week at the Calhoun Community Center from 12 to 6. Working for you in Richmond, I'm Matthew Foltz, CBS 6 News.